What up, this is Rama Screen covering movies, TV, and entertainment, and here's my review of Blockers. Let's rock this. Blockers is not an all-around consistently funny movie, but it has its funny moments. There were times at the screening where I'd be laughing hysterically, and there'd be times when I wouldn't even chuckle. But it's not a terrible comedy. It's not one of those movies where it starts out strong and then goes downhill halfway through to the end. I'd say the movie does what it's supposed to do in order to keep the momentum going. And I'd have to admit, WWE wrestler turned movie star John Cena has become a pretty darn good comedic actor. Who'd have thunk it? Leslie Mann, Ike Barinholtz, and John Cena play three parents who discover that their daughters have made a sex pact to lose their virginity at prom night. So these three parents launch a covert one-night operation to stop their teens from sealing the deal. I was actually looking forward to seeing this movie because the trailer was hilarious. And the concept is not too shabby either. Because unlike Porky's, American Pie, and Superbad, all of which featured horny teenage boys, it's the teenage girls that want to get laid instead in Blockers. So that alone makes this movie somewhat sort of kind of unique in a sea of movies about losing your virginity. Blockers also marks the feature film directorial debut of the screenwriter who gave us all those pitch-perfect movies, Kay Cannon. And I'm glad that Kay brings some of that comedic charm and heartfelt approach over to Blockers. I'm a huge fan of Pitch Perfect movies, if you can't already tell. But another thing that's also noteworthy about this film is how the teenage girl's male counterparts, or their boyfriends, I should say, the film depicts them as a representation of what respectable teenage boys should do in this situation, as opposed to what teenage boys would generally do. And that to me is not a bad thing, considering we are now living in a hashtag Me Too movement era. So something like this that informs and educates teenage boys on what to do, even through R-rated raunchy comedic setting like this, is something that I think audiences would welcome. So don't expect them to behave the way the characters do in Larry Clark's 1995 movie Kids. I think Ike Barinholtz, Leslie Manns, and John Cena's chemistry as the three friends' parents is excellent. Each of their characters has their own nuisance, but the way the movie eventually makes them out to be decent parents is admirable, to say the least. And lastly, John Cena cracks me up! His reactions and his comedic timing get sharper and sharper with each film. I sincerely hope he doesn't do any more of those cheesy action flicks like 12 Rounds or The Marine. Because if Sisters, Daddy's Home, Trainwreck, and Ferdinand and Blockers prove anything, is that audiences will always need a muscle-bound, lovable big guy. So that's it. That's my review of Blockers. Share your thoughts in the comment section below and share this video with all your friends on the YouTube verse and subscribe to my channel. This video is made possible thanks to your support on Patreon. So go to patreon.com slash ramascreen. That's patreon.com slash ramascreen. Sign up there today and become my patrons. Let's rock this.